Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I wanted to just go over this uh, PVC pipe that I glued one with this uh, ABS cement. So this is the black part and one is the PVC cement and uh, it's a clear cement and this is this part. So what I did was these pipes were just cut straight through and through and uh, I just slapped some glue on it and glued them together. So I was just wondering, you see the, the black glue coming out on this side and on this side it's the clear so you can barely tell. Now I'm going to do a test, see which one breaks first. <clears throat> Okay, so the, what is the cement? This is the PVC cement. It broke off with little to no force uh, on it. Well, not little to no, it took a little bit of force. Now, I'm gonna try the, what is this one? The ABS cement and see what it's gonna take to get it to come off. Ugh. on it, see if it'll hold up. Ooh. So for the ABS, it took about 200 pounds, probably 250 pounds, because I was jumping on it, maybe 300 pounds of force. I was kind of putting a lot of pressure on it. And yeah. I don't know why this is the ABS cement, it should be used for PVC pipes, it should be used for everything, it's a great glue. And um, these were just cuts, cut ends, I just bottled them together and let them dry overnight. And with the, what is this one, the PVC? PVC cement, it broke almost right away. Uh, I'm not a plumber, so forgive me for looking at the cans for the PVC ABS uh, cement names and everything. I'm not a professional plumber, I do um, bathroom remodels, so I do uh, put some pipes together, glue them uh, for pee traps and, and for tap drain sometimes when I have to replace just that. Uh, so yeah, that shows you what is stronger and I have no idea why they require this uh, PVC cement when they could use the ABS cement for PVC pipes and it looks like it'll hold a lot better. Um, Anyways, leave your comments if uh, there's a reason for all uh, for the re for the reasons for using the ABS cement, PVC cement, and thanks for watching.